We move on to this story. A stolen Amazon truck crashed and it killed a street vendor. Mm -hmm. CBS 2's Kyra Finstrom is live in South LA with how he is being remembered this morning. Very unfortunate for the family as well, Kara. It is DeMarco and the LAPD now telling us they have booked the suspect in this horrific hit and run with felony hit and run. Behind us, uh, you can see where candles have been lit uh, in memory of the man who lost his life here. This is where that stolen truck plowed up onto the sidewalk, striking the man who was working as a street vendor here. Uh, police also tell us they were able to identify that man, but they aren't releasing his name yet. They're still trying to contact his family. Two other people were struck and hurt. Fortunately, they're expected to be okay. Let's go to video now of that Amazon truck. Police say it was stolen as the driver dropped off packages less than a mile away. Way. And the LAPD have now identified uh, their suspect. They say he is 37 year old Christian Sanchez. They say shortly after the suspect took it again, now identified as Christian Sanchez, uh, they believe he slammed into a parked car and then hit three pedestrians. Police say it does not appear he was being chased. They don't know why he lost control. Detectives say the suspect then tried to run off, but a good Samaritan who saw what happened called 911 and authorities caught him. Our crew spoke with one of the other men who was struck, Gustavo Reyes. He says he often saw the victim selling items on the corner to make a living. He can't grasp what has happened. We also spoke with one of the officers responding. A citizen was able to, to see, uh, follow that suspect, call them one and direct uh, the, the police helicopter and responding uh, units. We don't believe he was being chased. Uh, again, for whatever reason, he veered to the right and hit a parked vehicle. And a spokesperson for Amazon issued a statement saying their deepest sympathies are with the victim's family and loved ones. They are actively working with the LAPD as they investigate. And back here live, the LAPD also tells us, uh, DeMarco and Suzanne, that some officers who were on their way here, they were responding, were involved in a separate collision. Fortunately, nobody hurt in that collision seriously. Uh, everyone said to be okay. Uh, but they are investigating both of those crashes this morning, and we'll bring you more information as we get it. That makeshift memorial there, just a reminder that a precious life was taken. Akara, thank you for that report.